Hello everyone. I'm reporting live from all the way from Garland. <laughs> As you can see, there's a fire that exploded right about in the in the AM in the PM. Oh crap. <laughs> see why did you tell me? In the AM today. There's some guys right there. This is very shocking news to all of Garland. <laughs> and especially we have a Garland resident here. Well, what? How do you feel about this Garland? How do you feel about this Garland fire? <laughs> Does it make you feel like you're losing part of yourself? <laughs> there it goes. This has never been seen in Garland until today. Everyone's just so shocked that this could happen in a town like Garland. <laughs> you know, this is always a quiet town. No one ever really causes trouble. You know? What a party! No one ever causes trouble, no, you know, it's a low crime neighborhood. For this, <laughs> for this type of things to happen right here in our streets, where our children go to school, where adults go to work. <laughs> Dang, the video looks nice, oh. Like good quality? Mm -hmm. I hope that's how it actually comes out. Here, just record me like while I'm driving. It's safer that way. Are you kidding me? It's safer for you to record me than me record myself. You don't need to be recording this at all. Ask me how I feel about it. Oh, and now I'm not gonna ask you. <laughs> yes, I do feel devastated. I mean, I didn't think something like this could happen in a town like this, you know? Today marks the ending of the innocence that is Garland. Garland. <laughs> the greatest town in the east of Texas. <laughs> oh, look, you can see it better. Adios. Industrial plant. Adios. So we're now stuck in traffic because <laughs> you wanted to find this fire, pretty much. Oh my gosh, look. That's great. She's huge. <laughs> She's mad. It's just engulfing and engulfing. Anyway, this is pretty sad. Everyone's pretty sad right now. Everyone's just, you know, like, I'm gonna go home. That industrial plant's gonna be there. And then this happens. <laughs> no one was expecting this. It's like 9-11 all over. She is. She's blowing. And blowing. And blowing. And she's mad. Because of people like us. What we do. Have we? Have we disappointed Garland? Is that why Garland decided to. For this to happen? You don't even live here. <laughs> Is it because, because, um, because several states became gay? Is that why she decided to blow today? Who did? Some states became gay or they legalized it. You didn't hear about that? 
just how they also legalize marijuana. You didn't hear about that? No. In Colorado and Washington? Oh my god. Yeah, for real. Is this Garmin's way of showing us? No more. No more. We don't quite know what happened here. But in the aftermath, after all is gone, we will find out, won't we? Anyway, I would like to take this time to say some last few words. You would be the last few words. What we've seen here today is not funny. No town, not even Garland, deserves what do you mean, that something. Means? Something as such. <laughs> Our lives got twisted, turned upside down. Let's take this time to keep all those citizens in Garland. That is ugly. <laughs> On that truck. The tattoo? Yes. Okay, anyways. <laughs> Let's take this time to think of all the citizens in Garland that are going to be affected. Such as Anne, the camera woman. She's very devastating. Sure. Well, thank you for watching this video. I hope this is not the last time you see me alive. That's what I'm saying, that it's been a free little try. Dang, she's really mad. I'm serious, she's really mad.